is up guys it's logic looks and today boys you guys saw by the title and the thumbnail what we are going to be doing i'm going to be showing you guys how to play draft for free there are a few ways you could actually use and there's a few things that you could actually do to get free draft tokens and this is very very important because obviously draft is one of the best game modes in my team in my opinion it's one of the most rewarding and of course if you haven't got that free pink diamond from draft and you still want it and have run out of tickets this video should help you out so we're going to get into it without further ado i'm excited man let's get into it let's go so boys, if you don't know already, man, Draft is definitely one of the best things in my team this year. I absolutely love it. It's honestly a very fun game mode. It's very rewarding as well. And again, you get a shot at a free pink diamond that if you guys have not already got yet, I would strongly, strongly suggest you guys try to get this card. It is, of course, this Glenn Robinson card. Now, obviously, some of you guys might want the card. Some of you guys might have ran out of tickets. And some of you guys are confused as to how to, you know, play more Draft games. Because obviously, you cannot buy in with MT, so you can't spend MT. The only way to actually, you know, play Draft over and over again is spend either 7.5 kvc or of course spend a draft ticket that you know you could earn through various ways so i'm going to show you guys in today's video two different things you guys could do maybe three different things you guys could do to actually either earn some free vc where you don't have to spend any money on the game and it should only take you like 10 minutes to get enough vc to actually you know buy into a draft and of course i'm going to show you another thing that you can do in my team that will help you get some draft tickets so we're going to get into it this might be a simple video but hopefully it helps some of you guys out because i'm telling you man draft mode is definitely one of the best modes that 2k added this year and i know a lot of you guys want to play it so hopefully this video helps you guys out let's get into it without further ado let's go so boys, the first thing you could actually do in my team turn yourself job tickets is some XP challenges. It might sound a little bit weird. If you guys know about this, then stay tuned for the other method because the other method is definitely something that even I didn't know until, you know, like last week. So the first method, like I said, is doing XP challenges. You guys might be wondering, why would I ever do that? I don't want mellow. Well, of course, you probably might not want mellow, but you definitely want to get these draft tickets that 2K has put up for free. They're actually handing one out each and every single week so far from what i've noticed and you got to complete basically three parts of challenges so this is right here is part one very very easy part one you should be able to run through in like 10 minutes if you're trying part two again it should not take you that long maybe like 30 minutes max and then part three it might take you a little bit longer because some of the challenges are a little bit tougher but again not really that tough to the point where you're going to be struggling with them it's just going to be a little bit time consuming so right there every single week you could earn yourself one draft ticket which might not seem like a lot that's why i have more methods to show you guys as to how you can continue to earn them but this right here is not bad at all i'm glad 2k at least gave us some free ways of actually you know earning draft tickets and right now if you're logging into the game there's three different draft tickets you could actually get if you haven't done any of them already and of course i believe the fourth one is coming on friday so there will be four available in total to go ahead and earn if you haven't already and i definitely suggest you do this before the season ends even if you're not grinding for mellow and grinding xp definitely go ahead and get those draft tickets i'm pretty sure they stack up throughout every single season so it is just important to go out and get them just in case you know they do stack up because if they do stack up you're gonna have free draft tickets for the future that you could use if you already have the pink diamond player from you know the draft right now there's no point to use you know them right now unless you actually just want to play the game and that's completely fine but again if you want to stack them up you can and honestly bro it's a pretty easy way to earn four free draft tickets and they're going to keep adding one every single week so go ahead get those done that is kind of part one of this video i mean these are pretty obvious you guys probably already know about these and if you didn't well now you know go out there do the challenges and get those tickets well, boys part two of this video the second way to earn draft tickets involves you actually earning vc now it is absolutely free vc it is not vc where you're gonna have to you know pay for it obviously that's not what i'm gonna make the video on i'm not gonna just say oh go out there and buy vc that makes no sense whatsoever the next way is to actually earn some free vc and to be honest it is well well worth doing this each and every single week now it might take you a minute to catch up with these because to be honest there's already four episodes i believe already out but once you catch up you should you know only it should only take you around like eight minutes to actually get through an episode and yes i am of course talking about 2k tv now obviously you can do this on current gen next gen whatever gen you want to do it on you got to press here you got to go to 2k tv right here on current gen and basically go to the first episode now yes you'll have to watch it it's not really that you know serious you don't really have to you know watch the whole thing you don't have to pay attention at all because i'm going to be showing you guys where you can actually get the answers and you guys see you guys will be kind of you know put up with the question which of the following nba 2k game modes are you most excited to play those type of questions you can literally press whichever ones you want for example i just pressed my team and you guys can see man 80 percent of people said my career but again as you move through the episode and i just by accidentally i think i literally just skipped the episode but as you move through the episode you're gonna see that you actually you know get a lot of different questions throughout the episode so once you actually you know do some of those questions you are gonna earn some free vc and i believe if i'm not mistaken you earn on average like 2.5k vc per episode maybe even more than that some weeks it's like 4k somewhere around there so de definitely 
a free way to earn VC that most of you guys, you know, might have not known about. And if you haven't known about it, definitely use it to your advantage because there's already four episodes out right now. That should be enough for like almost two tickets. And you guys can see who is the cover athlete for the WNBA. I mean, if you guys don't know this, it is Candace Parker, obviously. You can go ahead, boom, 200 VC right there. And the VC does add up from these episodes. I believe it's 15 questions per episode, which means, I mean, you're earning a decent amount of VC right there. So definitely get to this now if you guys are wondering yo logic i don't know the answer to some of these questions you do have to get it right to earn the vc and if you don't know the answers all i would do man go over on twitter if you guys have twitter or tiktok and just search up nba 2k22 2k tv answers and it will pop up i promise you bro somebody every single week gives out the answers in a picture and you guys could just you know use those answers to answer the questions in of course the episode and it should be pretty easy again honestly man definitely do this as soon as you can because it's just free vc that's sitting there and again you can use that vc to enter into the draft and get free you know draft tickets so boys the third and final method that i actually have for you guys it is something a little bit different now even if you guys don't play this game mode because i know a lot of you guys don't me personally i personally do because i actually find it a lot of fun this year but the third and final thing i gotta you know kind of recommend to you guys as to how you could actually earn some free vc to actually you know put towards draft and this is what i do with the vc that i actually earned from this you know game mode right here obviously it is my career slash my park now all you got to do yes you can play games if you already play games with your friends that's completely fine you could use some of that vc to put towards obviously you know my team and my team's draft but the second thing you got to do even if you don't play the game mode i strongly strongly suggest you make a build no do not go ahead and buy vc on the build all you got to do is just come do your daily spin each and every single day and you guys are going to see i'm going to do it right now now obviously you don't always get vc but every once in a while you will get like 10,000 vc sometimes you even get more than that right now you guys can see i did not get vc but if you stand around here you guys can actually see people that spin the wheel are eventually going to get a lot of vc and some people have actually gotten 200,000 vc a million vc from this so definitely if you don't already have a park build go ahead and make one it literally does not matter what your build is you don't have to spend any vc on it just come over here every single day do your spin because the spin is honestly very very important you get free vc it adds up i think in total in my personal like career i guess you could say or my, my personal time of spinning the wheel i have earned around i believe it's probably like close to 25 kvc from that so that's like what five four three draft entries somewhere around there and i know people that have gotten you know 200 000 vc as well as a million vc so go ahead spin that wheel that is kind of the third thing that i gotta tell you guys on how to earn some free vc and again if you play my career if you play pro aim if you play all these other game modes the vc will also add up and it's honestly free vc at the end of the day so go ahead make a build you do not need to play on it don't you don't need to do any of that go ahead and just spin the wheel and hope you get some vc from that so uh yeah boys like i said man a very very quick video today honestly i just wanted to go over the different types of things you guys could actually do to earn some vc as well as earn some draft tickets straight up like right through 2k so honestly bro go ahead use these to your advantage obviously some of them are you know kind of obvious like the the challenges i mean you guys should have known about them already if you didn't know about them go ahead and get those done because i mean it definitely does add up you guys can see you get one for week one one for week two you get one every week and those will definitely stack up especially if you're not playing draft that consistently you probably should still do these challenges because at the end of the day you're gonna have them stack up and when there's a really really good reward in draft and everybody is you know tempted to buy vc to play draft you're gonna just have tickets stacked up from just doing these challenges the second way you can make it obviously is by going ahead and watching those 2k tv episodes i would strongly strongly suggest that man if you're low on vc if you don't want to buy vc if you want to earn free vc go ahead and do those 2k tv episodes search up the answers on twitter or tiktok i know both of those you know platforms basically post the answers a couple hours after the episode comes out and i believe right now there's four episodes one drops every single week so you guys can get some free vc from that as well and then of course the last thing you can do is spin the wheel in my park obviously you know whether you're current gen or next gen spin the wheel earn some free vc from that that one is kind of luck based but again it doesn't hurt to try because you never know when 2k might throw 200k at you or a million vc at you and you'll be basically set for the whole rest of the year if you know you save it properly so go ahead use these methods i mentioned in today's video to play some draft mode honestly in my opinion the best game mode in 2k22 right now so go ahead use the methods earn yourself some draft entries let me know if you guys have earned the pink diamond from draft mode yet honestly bro this card is really really good i would definitely suggest you guys go out there and try to get it he's a good shooter he can pretty much do it all go ahead play the draft mode let me know if you guys have any extra tips that i didn't mention in today's video and i'll see you guys in the next one man stay tuned we got a week full of bangers coming up snipe challenge road to a million mt series coming soon as well stay tuned i'll catch you guys in the next one man i love you stay safe stay blessed leave a like hit that sub button if you're new i'll see you man peace